Hey, Dave, what did you see from the Phillies uh, pitchers that limited the offense today? Um, Suarez was good. Um, crossfire heater into the uh, righties um, with the changeup behind it. Lefties crowded him. Um, so he, he was good. Um, you know, we just couldn't get any traction, any, anything going versus him. And, um, you know, to see Archie go to and um, De Los Santos or Neris, uh, we just couldn't get to the guys in the pen today. And there has been two rain delays, of course, the heat today. And I understand the players, they will not and they have not made it, um, used it as an excuse. But do you think that these, the long game to the heat today has any impact on kind of the performance out there? Uh, I don't think so. I, I think that, uh, you know, Suarez made pitches, um, you know, that play that didn't get uh, that uh, bang, bang play, Turner, that, that was a big play right there. Could have flipped the inning of the game. But uh, I thought, uh, no, I, I don't think that the delays, the, the heat, anything played any part in us uh, uh, losing today. Um, I got to give credit to Mitchell White. He did uh, everything we asked of him. Um, you know, a C night grounder got him, a Harper homer, um, but he pitched really well. Uh, guys in the bullpen this entire series, they were they were outstanding. Um, so, you know, we got a reset. We got the uh, Mets tomorrow, and and we got to focus on winning a ball game. Thank you, Dave. Yeah. Next question is from Mike DiGiovanni. Go ahead, DG. Dave, um, I think the team's record now is 13 and 21 in one run games. Uh, does that surprise you at this point? Um, I, I, I mean, I, I guess I wouldn't, I wouldn't bet, um, you know, I wouldn't see, I wouldn't see that. I wouldn't guess that we would be like that in one run games. Um, a loss is still a loss. Um, I would expect going forward, we'll win more one run games, but, uh, you know, I, I can't explain each one run game. We have to kind of do an individual dive, but uh, I guess overall the win loss and that, yeah, it's probably. Good. Thanks. Next question is from Bill Plunkett. Yeah, go ahead, Bill. I'll ask that a little differently, Dave. Does the, the record in one run games concern you? Um, no, no. I mean, there's still losses. Um, I'm, I'm sure that if you look at each game, you know, whether it was a, a defensive play and, and an at-bat here or there, uh, you know, pitch here or there could have flipped it, but um, that's baseball. So uh, they still count as losses. And um, I don't think that that's kind of front of mind at all, um, you know, as we move forward. The play at first base, have you taken the time to uh, look at it? What did you think? I, I, so I, I think... I, I didn't look at it. I just saw it on the, uh, on the big board. I think the thing that's uh, interesting is uh, umpires are trained to listen for sound um, on, on force plays. And so as I heard it from Alfonso um, in replay, um, it's more of it's a visual thing, clearly, obviously. And so when the ball is touching the glove and not secured, um, it's still in their determination count as possession. And so if you look at the replay, it was not in the glove as far as caught, but it was touching the glove and that's why it wasn't overturned. So I think it's like kind of, uh, it doesn't add up to me as far as when you're looking for sound and securing a baseball versus it touching and not securing still counts as the same thing as far as an out, but uh, it is what it is. Did they explain whether the replay confirmed it or just just did not see enough to overturn? You know what? They did not. Um, I, I think that's, you know, for me, I guess it's semantics. It's it's kind of, he was still out, so I, I didn't ask. Thanks, Dave. Yeah. Last one's from Michael Dorte. Go ahead. Yeah, Dave, um, I know you said you expect maybe Justin to play this weekend. Was he unavailable at all to pinch hit in that situation with the bases loaded in the ninth? And then uh, depending on what happens with Mookie when he eventually is activated, is there a way because he says it doesn't the hip doesn't hurt him when he's at the plate batting that you can still find ways to use him, I guess, where he's not running? 
Um, Justin was uh, unavailable this series. Um, he'll be unavailable tomorrow. Um, I think the conversation will be Saturday what, what where he's at um, in what capacity. Um, as far as Mookie, I, I just don't know. Uh, once we get closer to his activation, um, each day we'll know more, but I can't even answer, uh, answer that with any type of uh, certainty. Thanks, Dave. Thanks, Thanks. everybody.